Hi, in this video I'm going to just talk a little bit about this ECDL um, resource that you're going to be using when you teach yourself how to use Word, uh, spreadsheets, presentations and that sort of thing. Um, there's a few little quirks as I'm going through this. I'll, I'll, I'll make a few videos uh, every time I kind of come across something that you need to be aware of or any kind of like little niggly things that might cause you a few problems like I'm having a few problems with like the lesson quiz and it's just to make you aware of uh, aware of it it's not that you're doing anything wrong in real life it's just the way this software works so um, I'm going to do this lesson quiz um, just kind of talk you through it so when you do the lesson quiz you'll get some instructions about um, about how you'll only have a certain number of attempts to do things it does talk yes, about only it. Only one chance to answer a conceptual question. You're required to perform the tasks you learned as taught in the lesson. So, like I said, you, you'll you'll get some instructions. Just begin the quiz um, and follow the instructions that you're given. Now, you have to do things exactly like the program wants you to do it. Um, don't try and take any shortcuts. I fell short of this quite a number of times. Um, so just follow the instructions exactly like it says. Expand the window if it has a lot of instructions and collapse it if it doesn't. See, I've accidentally clicked on something, so I've only got two attempts left. So I've, you've got to be really careful where you click. So a blank Word document is displayed. Using a file tab or using the file tab, open the document demo data, which is saved on the desktop. So I go file, and straight away I can see that it says demo data here uh, on the desktop. So I try to click that, but I lose my attempt because uh, I haven't done it like it wants me to do it. Instead, I need to go to computer. I then try to click on desktop, uh, which was a mistake again. You need to click on browse. I then try to click on desktop, desktop up here and it lost me my point. So I had to click on desktop down here. And then demo data is selected already. So I just click on that and click open. So you've got to do it exactly the way it wants it to do, otherwise you lose attempts. And if you click somewhere you're not supposed to click, you lose an attempt, you've got to get it exactly right. Um, so it's just to kind of make you aware. And if you try and skip a question, um, you also lose an attempt. So um, don't try and skip it. Uh, again, just follow it through exactly like it asks you. So here it says a blank Word document is open. Create a project communication plan. Uh, document by downloading a project communication plan template. So again, you've got to make sure you click on the right thing. So it's file, new. Make sure you type in exactly what it says. So it says create a project communication plan. So I want to type in project communication plan. Search for that, click on that and click create. So you've got to type it in exactly right. Otherwise you lose an attempt. Um, this is one I, I keep getting wrong, and I'm not sure why. So let's see if we can get it right this time. Save the display document as my letter in the local disk E on the hard drive. After saving the document, exit from the application. So I want to click Save. And then it says, save it in the local disk E. Now, I've clicked on Computer. Um, Let's see, I clicked on it, I already clicked on it, so I've lost an attempt. Click Browse, and then it says Save on the Local Disk E. Now, that probably means I need to click on this PC, not Documents like it's selecting. So, I, you know, before I clicked on Documents, that just shows what I'm, I'm already in. So I probably want to go PC, there it is. Click on Local Disk E. Probably have, you might have to double click it or single click. Then it says Save as My Letter. So I'm going to change this to My Letter. Really common thing, mistake, putting spaces in, oh, you, you see, as soon as you click somewhere, you're not supposed to click, that's it, that's the end of your go. You've got to make sure you do it absolutely perfectly. It's a real pain in the backside, but, you know, you've got to do it. This is how, uh, just kind of get used to the fact that you've got to do it this way. Um, and there is one question on here, which I keep getting wrong, because I, I select it, it's the ribbon question. Um, Let's just skip to it as quickly as I can. I've done this a few times trying to get the answers right. Um, so help tool on this one. So I'm looking for recovering a document. Just to show you if you don't get the spelling right. Oh, well in this case it didn't really matter, but I typed something in. Uh, recover a document, that's okay. This is the one. Uh, oh no, it's not, it's the next one. 
Don't try and use these bottom tools here like we normally do. Like I want to zoom into 200%, it won't let you. It wants you to go through view, wants you to click on zoom, wants you to click on 200, click OK. This is the one. A document in Word is open, minimize the ribbon. Minimize, that's correct, click next to continue. A skip question will be scored incorrect. If you get this warning, even though it says next, just accept it. It's probably just a little bug in the system. It's okay. Click yes. Uh, and this one's done. And at the end, oh, print. Oh yeah, uh, the view one. Don't try and use the shortcuts again. Like here's that's the website. That's the web layout view. Click on that. You lose an attempt. Don't keep clicking on it because you will lose attempts. View, web layout, next. Okay, and I keep scoring eight because I messed up, but whatever. Um, and there you go. So just just a few little quirks to be aware of. Okay.